Hey loves, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, welcome! My name is Vivian and I do reviews of the newest makeup product launches from low range, mid range and high range every once in a while and also makeup and beauty tutorials. So if you like makeup and beauty and want to stay in the know of what is new, subscribe. Subscribe over here where you see my YouTube logo or below on the red button that says subscribe. Click it, then click the bell and after click all so you do not miss my videos. I have thank you giveaways every once in a while also for my beloved subscribers. And for today, I will be chatting with you about my suggestions for this Sephora sale that everybody is talking about. And we cannot pass it either. So I did a breakdown of different beauty products so we can discuss them and go over them that I think that are worth to buy during this holiday sales event from Sephora. Sephora's holiday saving event will be running to November 9th. If you're a Sephora Rouge member, you will get a 20% off. If you're a Sephora BIB member, you get a 15% off. And if you are an insider, you can get 10% off with that coupon, which is again, holiday fun. The first thing that I want to tell you is that number one, my video is not sponsored by Sephora, like other YouTubers, that they have sponsorship and they recommend things and have affiliate links for that. So none of my links are affiliate with Sephora right now. And another thing that is very important is before going and jumping into the self and grab everything you need, first check those products that you want to buy to see if the actual brand has bigger sales event during Black Friday. For example, Hoda Beauty, at least the last two years, she always throw the house out of the windows. She puts, if not everything, almost everything in her website 50% off. And that is when I reload my stuff from Hotta Beauty because it is crazy. I hope that this year is the same again. And for example, Pat McGrath, she had last year 25% off her entire website too. Charlotte Tilbury has very good sales too for Black Friday. So make an analysis on how needed you are that you don't want to miss this sale against checking with other brands if they're going to have bigger sales. This runs till November 9th, so you have a time to do your research and check which things you want to buy from Sephora and which from other websites. Another thing that I like and I get advantage from this Sephora holiday sales event are the value sets. That's the first thing I look for. If this is the time of the season in which those value sets are launched especially for skincare and this is when I reload my skincare and I try to make it like for available for a year because the savings are insane and on top of the cheap price of the value set you get whatever discount you have from the Sephora membership in my case 20% off which is really good so let's start with the base the primers for primers, one of my favorite primers, which is really hydrating and it is a hybrid primer. That means that it has water and silicone in it. So it is very universal because you can use it with water-based foundations and silicone-based foundations. So it basically matches any foundation. It's this Marc Jacobs Undercover Coconut Primer. It is very moisturizing. It has coconut oil in it for girls with normal or dry skin. This is really good. Another hydrating primer is this water-based Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Hydrating Primer. That's a good one that you can take advantage of too. This is water-based, which pairs water-based foundations. If you want to go high-end, I have here the Guerlain Le Or. This is water-based. And this is the Radiance Concentrate with Pure Gold. And this is my favorite high-end water-based primer. And my favorite silicone-based primer is this one. And this is the Yves Saint Laurent Touch Eclat Blur Primer. And I love this. It smooths out the skin so well. This is how it looks. Now let's move to the foundation. 
my holy grail foundation this is my third bottle i barely do empties and many times i do not repurchase and to buy this three times it is because it is good this is the Marc Jacobs Remarkable and right now it is on sale at Sephora for $28. I think it's like $50 or so. I know that the, the original price is insane. And plus on top of that you get a 20% off if you're Rouge for example. Let's say you will get it like for maybe like maybe $20 or $20 something out of $54. That's the regular price. It is really good. Now this foundation is super super pigmented it's pure ink in here it's very full coverage but at the same time it's really soft on the skin because of the coconut oil that it has in it it's very moisturizing and i receive a lot of compliments when i use this foundation people always ask me because my skin looks really pretty 34 beige medium just for reference this foundation if you do not shake it before using it, you will not like it. That happened to me the first time. Then when I used it, I was like, Ooh, this doesn't work. What is happening? I read the instructions. I needed to shake it before using it. So if you use it, if you forget to shake it, you will not like it. I was shaken since then. I shake everything just in case. And for me, this is my holy grail because this covers even your thoughts everything and the skin looks so smooth really pretty another choice is the rare beauty foundation super soft on the skin so pretty so soft so delicate and has very nurturing ingredients in it and this is in the shade 210n rare beauty by selena gomez and another one that i discovered today that i liked a lot and it is the one that i have right now look at this it's the new hot beauty full filter skin finish foundation it is very pretty when you apply it looks very shiny on the skin but once you set it look at this beautiful skin like no texture everything looks so pretty i love it it is really nice now let's move to contour for contour i recommend the charlotte tilbury airbrush bronzer holy grail amazing and also i like a lot Hara Beauty's Tantour, which is a contour and also bronzer. This is in the shade medium. It's pretty dark. I love this thing too. For blushes, my recommendations are three. The Tarte Blush Authority Amazonian Clay Cheek Wardrobe. I have a video about this set. This set has three compacts. They are composed of three pans in each one. And most of them are blushes. There are two highlighters and one bronzer and these colors wonderfully well and it is really long lasting a lot of pigmentation long lasting this retails for 35 dollars plus the discount from sephora will be a great advantage to have this now for sale another one that is a holy grail that i'm planning to get more from the collection is the patrick ta blushes this is the major headlines double take cream and the powder blush and this is so so good and the shades that he has in his line are so beautiful so i'm planning to get the one that is like a brownish tone because it's very universal but i like them all and this is so beautiful so pretty the weird thing here is that you first apply the blush and then you apply the cream but it works so good and you can even use them independently so i recommend this this works wonders your skin looks so heavenly good and this is in the shade do we know her and the other recommendation for blushes is the rare beauty liquid blushes this is the soft pinch liquid blush and this is in the shade joy and i also bought the shade bliss but i forgot to bring it over here which is the light pink one and as you have seen in my videos a tiny dot like this can cover my entire cheek super long lasting you set it and you forget it doesn't go anywhere it is precious i love these blushes so those are my three recommendations for blushes setting powder compact setting powder i have here the you air compact setting powder and this is the soft focus hydrate and set powder this is the most hydrating and soft 
powder that I have ever had that is a setting powder and it is in a pressed compact and this is how it looks it is super creamy super soft on the skin and I love it the other one that I love that is a compact setting powder it is this one the urban decay all-nighter long wear mattifying weightless waterproof setting powder and that's one of the reasons that I like it because it's waterproof you can use this like when you're exercising when there's a lot of humidity in the environment and even though that says that it's mattifying it is a powder that my dry skin can handle doesn't dry my skin looks very pretty on the skin and I like you see that it's really thin so it's very portable in your purse or in your makeup bag and this is how it looks very good very long lasting those are my recommendations now let's move to setting sprays and i was eyeing that sephora has the all-nighter in the big bottles a duo a set i'm thinking about grabbing those because now with this mask wearing I and mean, maybe we will be for a while like that i didn't expect to use so much setting spray and they're like this one's like here and i have other one on the look that i will talk to you about later for highlighter, Natasha Denona, I need a nude glow highlighter. This is the one that I'm wearing right now. And as you can see, it is not blinding, but it looks very pretty on the skin. It's like a champagne color. Let me show you how it looks. You see? Now let's move to eyeshadows. For eyeshadows, I will recommend this new Pat McGrath Mother Chip Mega Celestial Divinity eyeshadow palette this is what I have right now on my eyes and I love it look at this guys it is beautiful beautiful precious it has 18 shades in it 18 pants and this retails for $70 usually all other Pat McGrath the biggest one that she had before this one were 10 pants for $125 mm -hmm. and this one has 18 pants for $70 and for example if you are a rouge you would just get it for $56 that's amazing this is one of my best recommendations in terms of eyeshadows my recommendations also for eyeshadows the rare beauty eyeshadows they are 25 and if you're rouge you would just get them for 20 which is good they color insanely good i can compare them even to pat mcgrath they color so good. I was really impressed. And also the makeup by Mario the Metallic and the Metals. Oh my goodness gracious. These are so beautiful. These are the Master Metallics. They are beautiful. Super highly pigmented. The Master Metals. Five for $48. It is insane the price. I know. But I haven't seen anything so colorful like this like when you wet it with the mixing medium that you need to buy for this which is this one this is the master metal manipulator the liquid this works so wonderfully well it is like having liquid foil honestly like that so that would be good to take advantage of them too natasha denona i liked a lot the bronze palette i like the glam one which is this one over here, but I prefer the bronze one. This is cool tones and this is warm tones. Let me show you. So I would recommend take advantage of either one if you like them. My favorite one is this one, but this one is precious too. So this will be a good thing to grab during the sale. For the brows, I like a lot lately more than Anastasia's. It is the brow liner from Benefit. This is the precisely my brow pencil in the shade 3.75 and right now sephora has like a set of two for the price of one something like that but it is in the shade 4.0 which is darker and the other thing that i like a lot is the benefit 24 hour brow setter this is my holy grail to set my brows now let's move to eyeliner and my favorite eyeliner so far that i would say grab from the sephora sale is this rare beauty liquid eyeliner it works wonderfully well super pigmented you need to shake it before using it because if not it will not work well i'm using it right now i have a fever of this eyeliner because it's so good and it colors so soft on the skin so pretty super highly pigmented 
I love this eyeliner. This is a most. For mascara, lately I'm using a lot this Charlotte Tilbury Legendary Lashes Volume 2 Mascara. And it is really good. My forever favorite is the Lancome Monsieur Big Mascara. I love this one, it's really good. The lips, I have here from Fenty Beauty this matte lipsticks. They are now on sale for $12.50 and I love them. They are matte, but they are not a drying matte and they are so pigmented. These are the Mademoiselle Plush Matte Lipsticks. So you can get them for around $10 on sale. Look how beautiful. This Moby color and it's available in so many shades, beautiful. I love them. And now for wearing mask, when you need like a long lasting lipstick, this will be a good one. Very pretty. And I also use a lot the Too Faced Melted Matte Liquid Lipsticks. They are amazing and for wearing masks, they are really good. The Melted Mattes. I love the pink ones. This is one of them. Let's move to skincare, to the face. My favorite like for years cleanser is from the brand Fresh. And it is the Soy Makeup Removing Face Wash. And they also have an exfoliant, which I haven't tried. I was looking for that because I always reload for this time of the season of that face wash. And then I saw that it was in combo with the exfoliant from Fresh, both for the price of one. So I ordered that one. I'm going to post a picture over here so you can see it. That was really good. For skincare, look at this. I need more. This is my holy grail for skincare. This is the Dr. Jart Ceramiding Cream. This has tons of different oils in it. It is perfect for winter season, for very dry skin. It is amazing. This is my holy grail, like my ride or die. To have very beautiful makeup, I go for this. This retails for $48 itself and I always for holidays look for value sets and yesterday at last I saw a value set with this and includes the ceramide in this one but the new version for the body and I was like yes I want to try that this full size plus the full size for the body for the price of this $48 and I was like grab it and check out at the beginning feels weird on the skin because it feels like really oily but dries out you don't feel anything so comfortable and your skin looks so pretty and the makeup on top flawless for the eyes my holy grail it is also from the brand fresh this is the rose hydrating eye gel this is the best hydrating eye cream for really dry eyes it's the best one that i have ever tried but this is my holy grail for nighttime and this is also from the brand fresh i tried this one and i fell in love lot of youth Preserve Dream Face Cream and this is so good. I put it on the skin in the night and in the morning I wake up so radiant with such a beautiful skin. As you can see, I emptied the container because it's really good. And basically that's it for face. Now let's move to hair, something that I'm loving lately. And this is from the brand Bumble and Bumble. And this is the Hairdresser's Invisible Oil. It is an oil and also a primer and hair protectant. It is a heat and UV protectant too. You spray this all over your hair before drying it out with the blower. And leaves the strands like so soft, so silky. It says that it's an oil, but you do not feel your hair oily. And it doesn't weigh down your hair. It is so good, I'm loving this one. I forgot the concealers. <laughs> For concealers, my holy grail are the Hoda Beauty Overachiever Concealer. And another one that I'm loving lately is this one from Charlotte Tilbury. And this is the Magic Away Liquid Concealer that I was, if you want to take advantage, but I always reload this one from Hoda Beauty's website. So I'm going to leave this one for Hoda Beauty's website. And the concealer, this is in the shade number 5 from Charlotte Tilbury. It's like a click concealer, let me show you. It has this like puff over here. And you can see the container, the amount that it has in here. And it's pretty good. Those are my recommendations in my wish list. I want to share with you guys my wish list, what I have gotten so far. I'm also sharing with you guys that part from Hora. 
I want the new, and I ordered it today because it was available today at Sephora, the new Naughty Nudes eyeshadow palette. It is precious. From the setting sprays, I saw YouTubers saying that Charlotte Tilbury's setting spray is really good. And I was wondering, is that for real? She said it's better than All Nighter setting spray and that's my holy grail. So All Nighter, basically chill, are my holy grails and I, I need to see that. I may be ordering it too from this sale or I will rethink it to order from Charlotte Tilbury. The Milk Makeup Hydro Grip setting spray. I ordered the small one because the large one was gone. Makeup by Mario. Today he launched his new Master Mattes Pro Lip Palette and that retails for $60 and I'm like mm, it hurts me to pay $60 for a lipstick palette honestly. It has many colors. The colors are precious plus has other colors to adjust the basic colors it has blue black and white and i think that yellow too so you can adjust those lipsticks it has like a metal palette for mixing them up but i don't know i have mixed feelings about that number one the price and number two would i use it for real how big is it I may probably wait to see if during these days other YouTubers launch videos about it and if I see good things I will grab it and if not maybe pass. And I also had in my wish list but I dropped it also in my cart is the Hourglass Mini Ambient Lighting Edit Sculpture Unlocked that retails for $58 and obviously I didn't want to pay that so I got that like for $46 now and I don't have any of those mini palettes because I find that every time I go to Sephora the shades are too light for me and this one looks dark at least in the pictures so let's see how it turns out if not it's going back to Sephora and another thing that I'm curious about and I have in my basket too is the Tower 28 Bronzino Illuminating Bronzer I like that too and I'm going to pick it up too so basically those are my choices for this holiday sale event from Sephora. My recommendations, my wish list. Look especially for the value sets. Those are the best choices for this season to get advantage from. And like I said, make sure that the brands that you want to buy doesn't have anything better during Black Friday. So I hope you like this video. I hope you like these choices. And I hope that you chop a lot and spend way less with these savings events. Comment below, what did you grab from this sale or what are you planning to grab from this sale? So thanks for watching and if you like this video, give me a thumb up, do not forget. And also remember to enter my giveaway and if you haven't subscribed, subscribe over here where you will see my picture or below on the red button that says subscribe. I hope you like this video. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye bye.